Hey everybody, welcome back to Big Red EDC. We've got sort of a little pup-sized knife to take a look at. Another pup from Vosteed. Now, of course, you guys know we did see the Corgi Pup here recently, as it's named the Corgi Pup. Well, this one is not, this one doesn't have pup in the name, but the size is what I'm referring to. This is the Mini Labrador. Now, of course, we had the full-size Labrador on the channel. I, I really like that knife, like the lines, the it, the way it felt in hand, the ergos were pretty darn good. Well, we've got us a scaled down version of that. Overall, you're looking, it's about two and a half inches, almost exactly, I think two and a half inches shorter than the full size knife. And the, the blade, I believe, is about an inch shorter, if I remember correctly. But yeah, just a smaller version of the Labrador. And we'll see just how smaller here in a minute. I, unfortunately, I don't have a Labrador here to make a full, complete size comparison between the two. But we'll do the best with what we got. Full stainless steel, stainless steel clip, backspacer. Do have a lanyard hole. Now, the one thing I was looking at is the clip. It, it looks to me like it could be reversible but they specify on the website that it's not. Now, it doesn't look like, from what I can see, I have not removed the clip. I have not removed it. So, it, it looks like it can be, but they, like I said, they specify on the website it is non-reversible. So, I'm sorry, my left-handed friends, if that is the case. But, uh, fit and finish, really well. Done very nicely, as we've seen from Vosteed. Pretty much the whole time. Frame lock, of course. There you're going to... It's giving me a little bit of a... We're cheating there. It's a 14C28N blade where I'm pretty sure the full size was 154CM. Uh, you definitely got flipper tab on the deployment. Pretty much a single deployment method on this one. It really has to do with the size, I believe. I mean, yeah, you probably could have done something, but then it would have been a Labrador, now would it? Nice. Detent's pretty good. Yeah, detent's pretty solid. Uh, it's a dropper. Quick shake shut. You're good to go. But yeah, this is definitely, definitely a mini. And we'll see with our size comparisons here in a minute. But overall, you're looking at, it's right about six and a quarter inches long. I believe officially it said 6.23. And that's, that's pretty darn close. I'm going to say six and a quarter just because it's a lot easier. You're looking at right about a three and a half ish inch blade, which is going to give you a two and three or handle, excuse me, which gives you a two and three quarter inch blade. Cutting edge is going to be more like two and a half just over from the looks of it. And your grip length right about three inches. So as you can see, I mean, obviously three and a half inch is my strong point so it's about a three and a half finger grip for me but i got a really good grip on it i have a very good grip on it actually and well we won't say that just yet we'll go back we'll wait we'll wait we'll go where's all my man oh here we go sorry it's like where's all my knives there you go. <laughs> there you go that should show you just about how small it is if the pm2 doesn't well the bug out will because if the bug out's bigger then it's a small knife and it is it is a small knife there you go as you can see the bug out is definitely much bigger than the mini labrador so it's a small knife absolutely let's get the scale out we'll throw a weight out here now there's something pretty cool going on at Vosteed right now what do we got? Dang, 1.9 or 55 grams. They actually have a pretty decent sale going on until the 8th of March. Uh, save 10% off of any two knives. Doesn't have to be the same knife. Could be different knives. There you go. Fits right in your pocket. Now, this one for me would probably be more of a fifth pocket knife. Fits in that fifth pocket just perfectly. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, just perfectly. I mean, this is this fifth pocket's even angled a little bit, but you put it, set it back there, and 
Yeah, it's right there. Looks good. Looks right at home in that fifth pocket for sure. And it fits very nicely. Now, on that fifth pocket, it's got a... Oh, there you go. It didn't have that much of a pop coming out of this one from what I remember. Let's see here. It's got good retention, though. Pretty darn good retention. So, now, what I was going to say earlier about it. It really is. It is a dang near perfectly scaled down version of the full-size Labrador. And why wouldn't it be? Because it's called the Mini. So, it, it does feel really good in hand. I mean, now, if you have really large hands, you know, or some people just don't like smaller knives. I get that. It might not be for you. I do kind of like smaller knives, if you will. So, for me, like I said, this would be a great little fifth pocket knife. Just throw it in the fifth pocket and roll right along with it. It feels really good in hand. Like I said, I've got a really good grip on it. That pinky kind of curls around the end and just solidifies that grip. I mean, it's a good size. You can get all sorts of grips on it. What's our lockup look like? Oh, of course, black on black. It's kind of... I mean, you're looking at a good... Out 50 to 60 percent on the lockup. Let's check out centering. Centering's pretty darn good. Yeah, we're right there. Centering's on point for a tiny knife. You know what? It's it's a great little knife. Like I said, 14C coated blade, full, pretty much stainless going on. I'm a bummer. I'm bummed that. It says the pocket clip isn't reversible. Like I said, I have not tried, but there's got to be something. It doesn't look like it's angled. Does it look like it's angled to you? I mean, no, I think that's just the way it sits. But it says non-reversible, so we're going to go with that. You know what, lefties, if you want to give it a shot, I'd say go for it. I don't know. But now these guys are selling, oh my goodness, was it 59 or 69? Oh, We'll say in that 59 to 69 range. It's right in there. It, it, it has to be because I can't remember. But I'm pretty sure it's right in that 59 to $69 range. Should have wrote that down. What I did write down to help me remember was what I said earlier. Right now through the 8th of March, Vosteed does have a 10% off of any two knives. So I wish you could get a Labrador and a mini Labrador, but I, you know what? I don't even see the Labrador. I have to Google search Labrador to find it on the Vosteed website. I don't even, I don't show it listed when you go look at shop. It doesn't even pull it up as an option. So obviously they must not have any in stock, but maybe a Corgi or a Corgi pup. Get you a family of Corgis. That'd be okay. You know, or get you, get you some puppies. And I was going to say watch them grow, but that really doesn't work because they don't grow. But you could get a mini Labrador and a Corgi Pup for 10% off. So there you go, for sure. But really appreciate you guys stopping by. Huge thanks to Vosteed for sending this little guy out. I, I do dig it. I really do. Uh, I was a fan of the Labrador. I, I'm a fan of the mini Labrador. It's just the way it is. So thank you so much, Vosteed, for sending it out. It'll get given away here at some point. Like pretty much most of them do. Really appreciate it. Thank you guys, as always, for stopping by today and checking out the Vosteed Mini Labrador with me today. Appreciate it, guys. Until next time, like, subscribe, leave me that comment. You know I love talking to you. Until next time, guys. We'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.